We saw it breaking right here on 7 Action News yesterday. A car explosion rocked a neighborhood, sent one man to the hospital. Oh, people could feel this one yeah. everywhere. Jeanette, that, that man is still recovering, and we're taking action for you to find out what can be done to prevent another blast like that one. 7 Action News reporter Anu Prakash was in Southfield as investigators returned to the scene. Investigators with the Southfield Fire Department came back to this house on Maplewood today in hopes of preventing another explosion, like the one that blasted apart this PT cruiser and rocked the neighborhood yesterday. Keith Rowley is chief of the Southfield Fire Department. My office is four miles away and I could feel the blast in my office. The blast was so powerful it blew the roof of the car way over here. Other car parts were sent almost 200 feet away. Investigators say a leaking acetylene tank in the car caused the blast. The driver of the car was trying to take these tanks to a Scrapyard. The acetylene tanks were left over from his landlord's old plumbing business. As soon as he smelled gas, he got out of the car. That's when it blew up. The 55-year-old victim was taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Anytime you move uh, compressed gas cylinders, you want to be very careful. You never put them in a confined space. Uh, secure them. Uh, transport them in an upright position. These cylinders, uh, most of them are very rusty. They're probably 20 to 30 years old. The gas inside can become unstable. Uh, laying them down flat is not the way to go, and that's what happened here. In Investigators say there are 17 tanks inside this car and at least double that number inside the house. So what happens with them now? We're told the man who owns the tanks is in his 80s. While it is legal for him to have them here in his home, neighbors told us they hope he'll get rid of them soon. Fire officials are working on helping him do just that. We can't force him and I can't uh, uh, break into his house and remove him. So we're going we're to do our best to uh, uh, suggest and uh, we're just concerned about his safety and, and uh, as I said, the community's safety. So we have to, we have to stay, on we'll, we'll stay on top of this. In Southfield, a new Prakash, 7 Action News. All right, have